Thanks, Phil. Um, interestingly, Phil started uh, what I'll refer to as the Divine era as, as a quarterback under Coach Divine, and I ended it. Uh, I was the co-captain of Missouri's 1970 team with Joe Moore, and uh, after that, Coach Divine left to go to Green Bay. The only good thing about being old is, is that things happened so long ago, people don't remember. <laughs> so, anything I say up here is probably going to be subject to challenge. we got John Burns over here who's, who's already pledged to do that. But <laughs> the, the, the reason that Coach Devine left wasn't that Green Bay offered him more money. It was because my eligibility was up. <laughs> Anyway, uh, I just want to, I had to write down some facts about the years Divine was in Missouri. Uh, and, and uh, you know, I don't remember him so well either, so I had to write him down. During his 13 years at Missouri, we won two Big A championships. We finished in the top 29 of his 13 seasons, and four of those seasons were in the top 10. We went to six bowl games which included three Orange Bowls, a Sugar Bowl, and a Gator Bowl victory against a Bear Bryant coach team that we beat 35 to 10. Yeah. Uh, it included eight All-Americans. 26 players were inducted in Mizzou's Sports Hall of Fame, and we had one inducted in the NFL Hall of Fame. Those are uh, pretty good numbers for a 13-year period. And, and I feel very, very fortunate to have played during that era because of the great memories you had with your teammates, the championships you won, and the kinds of things that you look back on at this point and count your blessings. 